What's up everybody, welcome back to Scars and Whiskey for our next review. Today's review is going to be a cigar by Punch called Sucker Punch. And this is the King Hit size. And this is a 6x54. And as you can see, it's got, they got a female boxer on the front of there. Very interesting band. And this is a cigar that's exclusively to FamousSmoke.com. So check it out there. Something they have that a lot of folks don't realize is you can buy these individually. You don't have to buy the whole box, so you can enjoy the cigar and see if it's something that you're interested in. As you can see, this is a Connecticut wrapper that is actually Ecuadorian Connecticut, and the binder is Cameroon, and the filler is a Nicaraguan Lengero Long Filler. So a pretty good looking stick. As you can see, it's got minimal seams, uh, and they're very... Uh, tightly packed together and it is a good looking stick now I'm a big fan of the punch cigar this is the first one I've seen uh, of this type so definitely try it out let you guys know what I think and uh, we'll be right back on the cigar we're getting a uh, sweet earth a little bit of hay almost like a honey profile like a sweetness that we're getting and a little bit of earthiness on the foot it is a definitely a good looking stick. So let's cut up and get into it. On that pre-draw, we're getting a really good draw off the, off the first part of the cigar. It looks like it's really well constructed, so it's gonna be a very enjoyable smoke. I'm getting a little bit of that sweet hay, and just a little bit of sweetness on the lips. I don't know uh, what that's coming from, but it's very interesting. So let's light it up and get into it. Getting a good draw, a little, a decent amount of smoke on the beginning. We're getting that sweet hay, a little bit of a sweet uh, fruity, maybe even a honey profile. And this is not something you would anticipate with a, a, a typical Connecticut wrapper. Uh, this is the first one I've had that is it listed it as an Ecuadorian Connecticut, so something different. And we are getting a little bit of uh, like a butter flavor off the smoke and a creaminess, a little bit of oak, and the other one might be a little bit of a hazelnut. But so far, a good start, and we'll be right back. Welcome back for the second third of our review of the Punch, Sucker Punch, uh, and in the first third was really good. You can see that the ash is holding up well. Uh, the burn is not all the way razor sharp, but man, it's a good looking burn. Ash is holding great. And the second third, uh, the flavors are mellowed down a, a tremendous amount from what they were. Uh, I'm getting a little more of the black pepper on the back of the palate. And the smoke is not as amp is not as predominant as it was in the first third, but so far a really good balanced uh, light cigar. Again, it does have a uh, excuse me have a Connecticut wrapper, so it is a little bit lighter on the uh, flavor profile. But I am starting to notice some nicotine building up in the cigar, so it might be one of them. The sucker punch comes in at the final third with a little more nicotine, but we'll find out. Stay tuned, we'll be back with our final third. Welcome back everybody for the final third of our review of the Punch Sucker Punch King Hit. In the final third, uh, profiles really are heart changing. The only thing that I am noticing is the nicotine increase, and I think that's probably where they come up with the names uh, Sucker Punch. Uh, but other than that, a very good cigar. Uh, as you can see, the ash holds up pretty well. And the burn's not razor sharp. But all in all, as I said, a pretty good cigar. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe. Always leave your comments. Thanks again for tuning in to Cigars and Whiskey. Have a great day. Have a great smoke. And I'll see you next time.